I suppose you saw a lot of games of Charleroi these last few days. So what do we have to watch out for, in your opinion? Oh, first of all, I want to say that now we're coming out of a very important week uh, with, with two very important victories, uh, not only in the cup, but also at a home game uh, that gave the, the team a lot of confidence. Now there's already f f forgotten because now we have the next very important uh, period with, with, uh, with three very important games, in even four in short period, and the first in Chalera, and, and they 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 have a very strong team, uh, so we have to be aware that everybody, and not only individual but as a team, we we reach a level a very high level uh, because if we do that, we have a chance. If not, it will be very difficult. But it will be a difficult game. But for me, the most important thing is that everybody is aware of the next game is the most important. Not always thinking and and talking about. Uh, Top six, not top six, uh, play of one, not play of one, but take one game at the time uh, and then focus on that for, for, for 100% because that's important. I suppose uh, some of the staff members already told you that Charleroi is a bit of a black beast for us. You know what that means? Um, in the last five games, for example, we've lost three times. Uh, the last win with more than two goals difference was from 2010. So... Um, there's always tight games against them. Yeah, we also saw that uh, thing was my second uh, game here uh, at home. Uh, we won two one, but it was more or less an equal game. Uh, so okay for me, statistics and history is something. Uh, for me, I don't care. Uh, what I don't care about is uh, the performance of the team tomorrow, and it is now very important game because not only uh, we're playing against opponent who are very close to us uh, but it's also very important that we now continue doing the performance with wins and get into a role where we build up some more winning mentality and that could be the perfect uh, way to do it to to win in Chalois. Tomorrow we all also have two important players who are suspended, Nana Azari the captain and Biri Verstraat in midfield. Um, are you thinking of replacing them with players who play in the same position like Thibaut de Smet on left back and Eric Smet in central midfield or maybe some players who will play in another position? Yeah, that's a good question and uh, those who want the answer have to be in Chalwa tomorrow evening to see uh, what choice I, I made. But of course we have players who can play these positions, who also played them in the last couple of weeks in the second team, but we also have uh, alternatives. We could change inside the team to to players to play other positions, stuff like that. So that is uh, the choice I have to make before tomorrow evening. Uh, but uh, I make sure I'll put a team on the pitch who is uh, capable of winning against Chalwa. Well, winning tomorrow would also be good uh, for the confidence even more and for the for the standings. I know uh, top six, not top six. We're very close to them now. Yeah, for me, the most important thing is to, to, to continue building on the confidence and the, the winning mentality. And that could be a perfect way to do it by winning uh, away at a very difficult place in, in Chiloa. So hopefully, uh, like we saw in the last couple of away games, a lot of our fans will, will, will join us uh, and help us uh, achieve those goals uh, because together we, we are stronger.